What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. It is Optus Troy and I'm sorry for being MIA. Busy, busy life. But guys, onward, we have a major main island update coming for Boom Beach. Guys, we are getting HQ24. Give it up, HQ24. Woo, woo. <laughs> yeah, guys, in that HQ24 upgrade, everything above all the mines are going to get upgrades, guys. You're going to be able to unlock to the next level. So everything below the mine line, sorry, you didn't make the cut. Shock launchers, sorry, you're staying as is. You know what I mean, jelly beans? Everything above here, guys, is getting a facelift. Um, even a really cool new board underneath. Anyways, guys, so it's all about the HQ. We are at HQ 23 now, but you can see there is a little arrow up, meaning, hey, we can upgrade it. And that means, guys, we are going to jump into HQ 24. Let's take also a look... Uh, at uh, what you get when you unlock 24. So there's the new HQ, guys. Uh, looking pretty snazzy, if you ask me. We got an extra boom cannon. We got a mine, a boom mine, and another shock mine. So let's actually instant that right now since we got a bunch of diamonds. And you guys, before you ask any questions, I have a million diamonds because this is the developer build that, uh, that, that Supercell grants to the content creators to showcase uh, you guys, some awesome sneak peek content. So let's just instant that right now. Oh, don't worry about that. And there is 24 right there, guys, in all its glory. Um, also, too, what I forgot to mention, down here next to the, uh, right here, uh, we have classified items now, folks. Now, this isn't going to pertain too much to the max level players because, as you can see here, um, they're basically revolving around for players that don't have max bases yet. So what I mean by that is you can look how you get these things. This is how you get classified items. You discover classified items in the depths of the sea using the submarine. So they're trying to revive the submarine, guys. How many times have we forget to take our submarine out, right? Um, but now you will find classified items with each sub dive or potentially with each sub dive you take. Uh, you can do get an attack plan, guys. Basically, the attack plan here, um, if I click this, says uh, this classified attack plan instantly finishes any troop or gunboat ability upgrade. Get your troops or gunboat leveled up and out to battle faster. So you get, this is kind of like a little perk, a little boost in um, upgrading your, uh, finish any instant troop or any gunboat ability. Here we got uh, building blueprint guys again instantly finish any building upgrade so this is kind of cool so like if you can grab one of these classified documents you can uh, choose a building to upgrade instantaneously which is pretty cool so take your subs out today <laughs> you got one for gold storage as well guys this will fill all gold storages which is really really cool um uh, definitely uh definitely take advantage of that one wood here's the wood guys again fills all wood storages you can you find a classified item in the sub with that stone iron and it's really nice um so uh on to 24 guys uh first off in the armory you, we we have to introduce a new troop guys the mech uh let's take let, well actually you know before we do that let's just upgrade the army to 24 right now it's going to cost you all that good loot, but we're going to instant that good stuff right there and take a look at 24. So your upgrades, guys, are the uh, troops that you see with gold coins next to them. Uh, the ones that say max level and are grayed out are the ones that aren't getting the upgrades this 24. So it looks like shock mine, flare, shock launcher, bombardier. You don't need an upgrade, bro. You're Gucci, bro. Um, all the others will get an upgrade, guys. So if you look at the uh, Johnson here, level 24, um, there are his new stats right there. Um, we got the heavy as well. There's the heavy to 24. Uh, there's the Zuka. There is the warrior, guys, to 20 to 22 as well. Uh, there's the tank. Guys, if you love your TGM, your tanks, there you go. Got tanks getting a big upgrade. You got the medic moving to level 15. We got the grenadier moving to level 14. Uh, we got the Scorcher guys uh, moving to level 11. Look at the extra stuff that he gets, um, which is going to be nice. So if you guys are a Scorcher fan, definitely. Cryonier, not too many people are running into Cryoneers. Let's use an RZCM. But there's RZC, R there's the Cryonier getting an upgrade. Um, the Mech, guys. Here is the Mech, a new troop. Now, when I first got a glimpse of this thing, I could have swore that the developers were like, 
dreaming about Star Wars. I mean, how many of you guys believe that this looks like something out of Star Wars, like the Metal Earth, right? Those those things. It's funny. I'm going to show you some gameplay on them, guys, a little bit later. Uh, artillery, guys, is moving up, too, as well in the world. So you'll be able to upgrade that. And there's the damage increase with level 24. Uh, med kit also as well. You are going to get another extra 75 and heal, which is nice on a level 24 med kit. And then barrage, guys, is getting another 1305 in extra damage. Boom, baby. Uh, that's level 20. We have more uh, smoking power, guys. We're going to add one more second of smoke duration to a level 7 smoke. And critters, guys, you're going to get one extra critter, guys, making it 14 at level 9. Uh, mine, you're going to get, uh, you're just going to get a little bit more damage on the mines. Not uh, boom mines, a lot more damage, 520, which is a nice little grab there. So boom to the boom mines. Um, and then that's pretty much it. Next, I also want to indicate that the heroes, a couple heroes are getting also upgraded, level upgrades, guys. Let's take a look at who they are. We got Everspark and Bullet are each upgrading into a new level um but with an upgrade to ever spark guys you can see she can get a little more health uh damage per second increases a little bit so let's give her a nice little boost here and go take a look at ever sparks new good stuff here so uh oh it looks like she's just getting an upgrade guys it looks like the uh, the 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 uh all the, the the levels are not getting uh j just just her just her her main character is getting the upgrade sorry uh bullet as well guys gets another upgrade as well so uh, you can see here he does get a little bit more health uh damage per second obviously increases a little bit so uh, again it'll cost you some some good loot there for bullet so um oh actually i want to show you really quick uh, what it is guys let's let's upgrade uh like that right there now you can see here it's going to take a day and 18 hours to upgrade bullet to its final max but you can see here next to the diamonds there's that classified folder if you click on that it says do you want to finish the upgrade of private bullet using an attack plan so again when you have these uh you'll be able to use these for certain characters and defenses so i'm going to try it just let you guys see how it works this is coming from that classified folder. i'm going to bust that and boom upgraded complete private bullet is at now at level 10 so there you go that's how you use the classified so whether you're using it on a hero a troop or a um a, a storage um, right here or one of the defenses over here you can definitely use it on one of those which is really nice so all my friends out there that don't have max bases yet that is for you um so guys with a 24 i also want to say look at this check this out guys you can see the statue the sculptor gets an upgrade as well guys and you know with an upgrade we get an extra statue so instead of having 10 we now have 11. Yeah, we're going to upgrade the Sculptor to level 9. Let's get that instant right there. And you can see now uh, we can build another statue. Everything here gets upgraded, guys. You can see here all the flamethrowers, machine guns, can uh, mortars, sniper towers, cannons. Boom, cannons. I want to show you guys the new little board they get. So let's upgrade this flamethrower now and we'll instant it. And look, the board now changes to a... It looks like a stone color more of a it doesn't look like it's different other than it actually looks like a stone it looks like a block of stone it's sitting on <laughs> again you guys can see the new stats on all these again there's the new stats for the flamethrower we got the machine gun if you want to upgrade that you're going to get a lot more you're going to get that much juice um a mortar you want to check that one out guys there is the stats on the 25 mortar uh sniper tower we can see that you're going to get those stats at 24 the cannon there are the stats for the cannon 24 uh the boom cannon oh i don't want to move you er, okay uh there are the stats for the boom cannon rocket launchers guys oh let me collect all that and rocket launchers are going to get a little bit of a damage increase along with the health and that'll that'll be good That'll be good, right? Rocket launchers. I was kind of sad that we didn't get an extra rocket launcher, but you know, hey, three, whatever. We're, we're good. We're good. Uh, also, the residence level, guys. You can see here will hold uh, thirty thousand more gold, um, and you'll get more gold per hour per residence, which is nice at rank eleven. Uh, we got uh, iron storage here, guys, holding an extra five hundred k in storage capacity for uh, some iron. And I believe that'll go for the all of them as well, right? That'll go for the stone as well. 500k, yes. And the wood is also 500k. 
and you get a little bit more health as well on those as well. Uh, wood, you, I mean, on the gold storage, you get 500,000 as well. So everything's 1,000, guys, uh, 500K up in increase. And then we also get an upgrade to the vault, guys. So how much more we can hold. So if you want to upgrade that, there are the capacities now. So plus two and uh, protected. So in, instead of the 88% protected, guys, from when you get rated or you get base rated by other players, you get a, now you get to protect 90%, which is kind of nice. You, you get a little bit more bang for your buck there. We're also getting up upgraded landing crafts and you know what that means yes it's going to carry one more troop capacity you know what that means also folks that's going to be two scorchers per boat and if you want to drop two scorchers there they are guys two scorchers per boat so if you wanted to go bust out all scorchers on a, on ma on max landing crafts 24 you'll have 16 scorchers guys so yeah that will be flaming hot okay that's it guys i mean if you look at it right there that's a lot that's that's his hq24 coming to the main island here um and that's really cool so it'll be interesting to see how you guys utilize these upgrades what you guys think let me know in the comments below what you think of hq24 and what what it means for boom beach because i'm excited i'm really looking forward to seeing how this all plays out but what i'm really interested in seeing guys is look at this Here's the mech kind of boasts the health of a Scorcher. Um, his damage is pretty decent, too. At this instant, let's see what he goes to rank 8. Let's take a look now at the mech. I think that's it. I think it goes just to 7. Okay, guys. So let's load up all the mechs on the uh, landing crafts right now. Pretty darn big, right? They're just like, hello there. You can't miss us. We are all loaded on the boats. <laughs> um, also, I forgot to mention too, guys, your gunboat is also getting a lift as well. You'll get one more gunboat energy on this little rank... Uh, 23 upgrade we'll just do it for the giggles here we go we're gonna drop bullet like this and i'm gonna drop the mech guys it costs 12 gunboat energy as well uh to drop these bad boys which i forgot to boost so uh you can see here watch how they go they kind of get about the same the same range uh as zookas and they're just firing uh, you got a boom cannon that's weak i'm gonna flare them up over here and we'll shock we'll shock over here I'll bust out, bust out a shock knuckles here. That's gonna shock where I just shocked. But you can see here, you got you got them getting hit by cannons and boom cannons. Um, they do take a lot. Of, they they do take a lot to take them down. But you can see here, with just a protection of some shock bombs, uh, you can definitely just kind of. They move very slow. You can see they move very slow. Um, and uh, obviously, you can med kit them, right? Um, but these are the mechs, guys. Just kind of moving super slow. But getting the job done, right? So, I mean, I don't know. What do you guys think of the mechs? Do you like them? Do you think they're going to be useful? And look, look what I'm talking about. They walk like like Star Wars. Look at it. It's just, they just remind me of Star Wars, guys. They just remind me of Star Wars. And uh, so, yeah. There is the mech. Boom. Code Chicken 2. Boom. Let me know, guys, in the comments below what you guys think of the mech, what you think of the whole HQ24, um, everything, the whole kit and caboodle uh, for this update. I'm looking forward to it, seeing what fun comes out of it. I hope you guys, too, are. Anyways, folks, thanks for watching. Have a great rest of the day, and we'll see you on the battlefield, Commander.